Maybe we should check other Novacore stations to see if they're all right. Hey, Drax. You all right? You must be feeling pretty crap about having to punch through all those coughs back on the station. Uh, do not worry. I simply need some time to get my thoughts in order. Right. Never thought we'd have to fight Novacore. The soldiers we encountered were not acting like Novacore officers. And those robed priests, it was all very disturbing. Assassin! You believe the events unfolding aboard the rock qualify as a mutiny? Co so those coordinates? They're in your console. Got it. Nowhere, here we come. and home to the best black market deals you can find. And surprisingly good noodles. You ever wonder what kind of person found it was like, Oh look! The severed head of a giant celestial being. Let's drill holes in it and live inside. They wanted the brain tissue. Very rare. Very valuable. The marketplace came after. Along with the noodles. You are certain this Cosmo is trustworthy, Peter Quill? Of course. He's chief of security. <laughs> and nowhere. And as such, probably deals with Novacore all the time. Trust me, he's gonna want to know about the rock. What are they doing back there? Shenanigans, likely. See you never, flark bags! A rocket and Groot. Did they really leave? Yes. It looks like it. Do we know where they went? Well, did you end up talking to Rocket after he stormed out of the You require the room? rodent to use the workbench. Don't think he was in a talking mood. Yeah, no. Rocket would kill me if I touched his tools. Hmm. Maybe not without Rocket. So, Drax, where do you want to partake in liberal libations? Try to behave while we're gone, okay? Maybe when we get back, I'll ask Groot to give you a bath. Hypothetically, if Rocket and Groot don't come back, I wonder if we should rename the team. At least you're still here. I wouldn't want to miss your meeting with Cosmo. Fine, whatever. We'll talk to Cosmo and then we'll go out and have a good time. You think Cosmo will actually believe us? Like I said, we go way back. Plus, he's probably already heard about what's happening. All we do is confirm the rumor. Maybe he'll even give us a reward. Spaceport seems busier than normal. War always moves the poor to the frontiers. The Galactic War was over 12 revolutions ago, and we're still waiting for the fallout. Some wounds heal, while many scars remain. Them. They left. What am I supposed to do? Chase them down and beg them to come back? You could apologize. That's your advice? The apology does not need to be sincere. Then what's the point? I guess if we ever see him again. Big if, by the way. But if it happens, then maybe I might think about it. 
Anyway, once we let Cosmo know what's happening out there, we'll have more time to think about what to do with Rocket. If Rocket doesn't come back, we'll need a contingency plan for getting rid of the Nova Tracker. Why? We have not yet spent our ill-gotten gates. We could still pay the fine. But we'd have to go all the way to New Xandar to do it. What if we get there and it's compromised too? There's gotta be someone shady enough in the market for help. Maybe. But Cosmo deals with Novacore all the time. Maybe we can pay the fine through him. How do we find this Cosmo? We head to his tower on the far side of the market. That's where he keeps an eye on things. Hey there! I need to talk to Cosmo. He in his tower? Should be. You know the way? Head straight through the market. Cosmo again. I guess I kind of miss the old boy. How exactly do you know him? Was he also a prisoner of the Chitauri? Nope. We met right here, back when I was in the Ravagers. Dishonorable killers and thieves. The Ravagers actually did some good during the war. Even the mangiest of mutts will behave. It befits them. Whatever bad stuff we all did is behind us. We're the good guys now. Right. Heroes for hire. Except no one will hire us. Maybe Cosmo will have a fetch quest for us or something. Any word on your Nova? Corps? Keep an eye on your things. These kooks are a bit hands-on, if you know what I mean. There were people who claimed to be able to see the future, sure. Do you mind? You're making me uncomfortable. We're unable to predict its demise. No one could predict what Thanos would do. Mad Titan will pay for everything that he has destroyed. He's gone, Drax. His death helped end the war. You are his adopted daughter. Do you believe that? <laughs> Mantis, what are you? Do you still have those suicide allergies? What? No. And you thought joining a team would be bad for you. Hi. Sunlord, right? Is it Rockstar? It's Starlord. Hey, that's right. I forget which version of you I've met. Did you do the thing yet? What is the thing she is referring to? No idea. Hi. I don't know if we've met yet. I'm... No. No, no, no. It's not... Oh, oh you poor... No, he's lying! I mean... Oh. Where the Kotati he wrote, the broken promise of all will be mended. Less depressed. Thanks. Don't worry. It's always weird the first time. Celestial Madonna! Ah. Uh, Hi, guys. You should not be in this place. Actually, I'm exactly where I need to be. I think. No. Yes, this is where I need to be. Or needed to be. Am needed, yes. Wait, why are you here? You cannot keep leaving the sanctuary. It's not safe. There are rumblings in the galaxy. <laughs> when aren't there rumblings in the galaxy? <laughs> yeah, okay. If you're gonna keep making my face. It was nice seeing you again, Gamora. Star guy. Me. Okay, bye. So, Gamora, you and Mantis seem close. We've met. Okay. You're being evasive, woman. Wait, 
Woman? That's the nicest thing you've ever called me. Uh, I'm not gonna ask, but if you wanted to talk about it... <sighs> we met after I escaped from a failed job. I, I was in bad shape. Don't you start eyeballing me. Hadn't found me. She saved your life. Yep. End of story. That is not the end of the story. I know, big guy. Let's just not push it right now. You seem to know the insect woman here, Will. But I should not remember your name. It's a wonder this head hasn't song. collapsed in on itself oh, yet. Yeah. Who are those men with the insect? Huh. Hey, dude! Hi, Groot. Rocket, you can't... Just ignore me! We gotta talk about this! <laughs> so, you want us to bring them back here? Not necessary. Transport will be waiting once you've captured the target. That'll work. We'll be in touch. Ah, let's go, Groot. What's the big idea, man? Think you got me confused with somebody else, pal. Come on, Rocket, let's talk about this. Can you believe this guy? You can't just quit. We need you. Oh, well, uh, I don't need you. Find some other sucker to keep your shit together. You're more than just... I know that blonde mop anywhere! Eat a queen! Uh, actually, maybe we can stick around for a bit. Last time I see you, you was running away from Mordidia. With your britches. Off and done. Get ready for a fight. I'm always ready. What the? I don't know what's going on here, but I thought we was friends, Eta. Or did you forget about me? What? What? No, no! Man, who could forget a face like that? <laughs> <He's not me. laughs> this is great! This is bad! This is really bad! Remember! <laughs> Ita! You and me! Star Riders! Together till the end! What is he talking about? Oh, oh, oh! It's a song! Right? It is? Of course it's a song! The one that was playing when Peter and me made our unbreakable blood oath. We did? Unbreakable blood oath? That is a serious commitment, Peter Quill. Whoa, no, 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 whoa, whoa, wait, 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 of course, I, I remember. Y you, me, uh, the, the music? Tells you what, Peter. How about you and me? Storm ride together! One more time. Here we go. You uh wanted to sing a song. Together till the end, gotta finish the fight. Cause this storm gonna rain till the end of the night. Come on, Lita! Together! Roaring like, like a hurricane! Like the storm! Storm! My sweet lover! Yes. I always knew I was gonna die in a bar. 
Are you messing with me, Eta? That's not the chorus! Keep going! And get it right this time! Let's go! Together till the end, now we look to the sky! Let me strike twice, now it's us to the fly! Sing with me, Eta! Driving through oh, the pouring oh, rain, rain. Right the dawn Kiss my cherry little <laughs> lips Oh boy Kiss my... What? Are you making fun of me? This is ridiculous. I see no lips on this creature. Stop talking about my lips! You didn't forget. This is an insult, Eater. We swore a blood oath. L listen, listen. I get hit in the head. A lot. Makes me forget things. That is true. What do you think his name's on his jacket? You swore a blood oath. How could you forget our night on Malilia? O okay, so I, I forgot, but in my defense, I didn't even know she was a planet. I ain't gonna kill ya, Eater Quill. Cosmo has been cracking down on the little islands, and I don't want to end up in his jail. Good. That's good. Oh, for Flark's sake. Let's go, Groot. But if I see your treacherous haste again... You're dead. Yep. Got it. Maybe we should get out of here. Let's just give it a second in case he's waiting outside for us. For you. He does not wish to kill us. Mm-hmm. Right. Feels like I got something stuck in my throat. You want something to wash it down? No, thanks. Was hoping for a friendly ear, though. Never was one for small talk. Especially if you ain't a paying customer. I know a secret, Darren. I thought I was gonna have a space. You wanna know a secret? I'm just an illusion, a specter. I'm not really here. I couldn't tell. You look real enough to me. I think I was good. Wow, you've got some friends, Peter. I doubt we're friends now. Lots more ghosts hanging around. Something is making them come back. I've seen some crazy things, but ghosts? <laughs> I doubt it. Something's up. What do you mean? I just hopped back from <clears throat> I need to leave. Uh, something wrong? It's not your business, Peter Quill. Do not wait for me. What the heck was that? Drax! Watch it, Star Lord! Watch yourself, jerky red guy! Can you believe that? Gamora? Gamora? <sighs> I guess I go talk to Cosmo alone. <sighs> <sighs>